face is darker than your body or you have dark spots on your face you have hyperpigmentation on your face you are having an uneven skin tone on your face or you are having sunburn on your face then trust me you want to stay tuned to the end of this video do not click away okay we'll be right back <laughs> Lovelies, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. So, like the tone that actually made you click this video, in today's video, I'm going to be reviewing a face cream. This video is not going to be a long or a lengthy video. I'm going to be reviewing a face cream that will help to get into that two shades lighter complexion that you have because I've gotten a lot of DMs, a lot of you put on the comment section asking me what face cream should I use please can you recommend the face cream for us to use so I'm going to be recommending this face cream and also reviewing it and also telling you how to use it and above all like this face cream is very very affordable okay elixir light with a tayon dark spot remover face cream so it moisturizes so well on your skin it absorbs well on the skin it doesn't give you a burning sensation on your skin and unlike some face creams you're going to use it gives you a burn sensation on your skin no this elixir light um, with a tayon dark spot remover face cream does not give you any sort of burning sensation on your skin it fades away dark spots if you are having dark spots on your skin this elixir light with a tayon um, dark spot remover helps do what fade away dark spots this face cream also does what it also minimizes rashes pimples if you're having rashes or you're having pimples on your face it also helps to minimize it for your face i actually got it for dark spots i wanted to try out something new a lady in the cosmetic store recommended this product for me so i actually tried it but i found out that it was not only it does not only work for just dark spots alone it was also helping to do what brighten and lighten up my skin so because of um, I do not want to be three or four shades lighter I had to minimize the way I was actually using it because if I was to use it for like two weeks straight I would have been looking white so now let's quickly look at the ingredients so it has argan oil carrot oil vitamin E, rose hip oil, sodium lactate, it has lactic acid, it has AHA, azorbic acid and it is that lactic acid that helps to give you that exfoliating effect because whenever you apply it on your skin, it actually makes you sweat a little bit but if you are in a cool environment or in a, if your temperature is cool, you're not really going to sweat that much it has fragrance, so if you have a sensitive skin you might want to carry out a patch test before using it all over your face to know how your skin will react to it. If you, when you have to reapply it on your skin, it's giving you a burning sensation, then you know that you want to stop it. Or when you apply it on your skin and it's itching your skin or it's breaking you out, then you're like, okay, maybe it does not suit well for your skin. But regardless of it, it will not really give you that kind of burning sensation if you're a dark skin person and you do not really want to lighten up or go like two shades or a shade lighter than your complexion you might want to stay away from this cream because it is definitely going to lighten you up okay but if you have dark spots in any area you can apply it there you can watch it carefully or you can just use it to brighten up your face a little bit because when it comes to the brightening it has that iron and it, it has vitamin e carrot oil is infused in it so definitely when it comes to the lightning it is going to give you that lightning effect and it says here zero paraben and hydroquinone free that it does not really have hydroquinone one very good thing about the cream is that whenever you apply it on your face it does not give you a discoloration like it evens the skin tone now how to use these face cream if you have sunburn, dark spots, for whatever reason you want to actually get this product for, I would recommend that you use this product at night so that you get your maximum 
results okay the lighting effect is actually strong because you get to start seeing your results in three to four days you see, that's how fast it actually works so i recommend you use it at night even though it's written here as you can see that it has spf 45 please ignore it <laughs> if you must apply the cream during the day you want to make sure that you are using it with your sunscreen don't make that mistake of wearing it and not wearing a sunscreen on you just use this face cream at night then during the day you can just go in with your normal moisturizer your face moisturizer then your sunscreen the SPF may not really be enough like I said earlier so it is not mostly it is highly preferable that you use it alongside with your sunscreen so if you're confused on the particular sunscreen to use you don't know the sunscreen to use Come on, I've done a video on sunscreen here on my channel and I, I think I picked about 5 best sunscreen that are going to do so well for your skin so if I want to check that video out so you will know the one to actually start up with For your body, if you are having dark spots on evil skin tone on your body I've also reviewed lotion Am I not so sweet? Like, not that it's have a hug right now But please guys, like this video Like this video Am I not just so amazing? Like, come on like this video now like it like it like it, like it. <laughs> i've reviewed lotions that would actually help to do what fade away dark spots on your skin like, this is a disclaimer for me to you do not use this face cream for a long period of time if you know you don't want to get like four or five shades lighter after you've gotten your results the um complexion that you want to get you, you could not be using it like consistently anymore you could be using like two times three times not like everyday clean you can keep up with your normal face moisturizers okay so yes yeah, so that is that about this eliza light complexion i just keep, i just don't put across this eliza light dark spot removal face cream for sunburn hyperpigmentation and i tried it and i also recommended it to a friend of mine and i also recommended it to someone and it actually worked for them like she's she was actually dark skin and her face was looking so dark her face was actually literally darker than her body and she was having some spots so i recommended this face cream for her and she used it in a week and it's brightening up her face so after i brighten up her face i asked her to stop using it and she keep up with her normal moisturizer since she has gotten that result that she wanted to have so i just asked her to discontinue it and lastly always use a sunscreen like i've been saying always use a sunscreen so this no i did not really intend for this video to be very very long i'm going to just review this particular face cream here for you guys and let me know your thoughts about this face cream before have you tried it what do you think about it have any questions regarding this face cream that i just reviewed please come down to the comment section and review it right and it is very very affordable it is not even up to i think it's not up to 2000 naira now it is below 2000 naira so it is very very affordable it's very very affordable and it's actually very very mild to use and it gives that quick results that you want to have okay so that will be all for now in today's video thank you guys so much for tuning in don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like don't forget to check out my previous video on sunscreen and lotions for dark spots and also check other videos like if you have any questions regarding skincare you can check out my channel if i haven't reviewed it then you can come to the comment section and be like hey chama what's up you have not talked about this and trust me i'm going to talk about it in my next video thank you so much once again do not forget to like subscribe share comment and until then i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys